What's going on guys? Chad Rulig here from For The Fallen Dreams. Let's check out the digs. We are currently on tour right now with our good friends in Gideon, Orthodox, and Guerrilla Warfare. We're about two weeks into this run. Super excited. Everybody's been great. The crowd has been great, so we're excited to be out here. Most of the driving is done by myself, Mark, and Eric, our guitar fill-in. Uh, this, is, this is where all the driving gets done. Two captain's chairs. We always have, since there's only three of us driving right now because um, we're all a little scatterbrained on who can handle this rig and driving it. We usually have another guy who doesn't drive uh, being the uh, the eyes and ears as the co-captain. But this is where all the driving gets done. Um, up here is the crow's nest. This is where Mark and Damon sleep. Uh, don't be fooled by the folded blankets because before y'all got here it was a complete mess. But they went and did their due diligence to make sure we look like we're taking care of everything. So. They folded this, they got their tune squad, LeBron James, greatest basketball player that ever lived. So if we hop up in here, we're marking them, or he's always got one. He's always got, I'll talk about Chico back here. My man always has them. Uh, we have our TV over here. We like to stay up to date on all of our NBA games uh, throughout the tour. So we're always pulling this guy out, hook it up to the laptops. Uh, if we have an off day, we do the we do the movie nights where everybody can't decide on a movie. So we usually just put on a uh, dude where's my car, and that's just kind of where it goes. Um, but yeah, so this is our sound guy's uh, weird pillows. He's been picking up throughout the tour. I don't know what they are, but someone said they're worth money. They're like Beanie Babies. I have no clue. Uh, up here, PS4 time. This is Mitch, our merch guy's uh, PS4. He is in charge of getting all the video games to to be streamed and to work. Some Tony Hawk Pro Skater, of course. Um, and that's about it as far as entertainment goes in this area. All the kitchen here, we had our good friends Steve and Stacy. They literally just came off the rig. They brought us some LaCroix. You can't go wrong. Some barbecue Pringles, my favorite. Oranges, chips, honey mustard and onion pieces. I'll tell you what, too kind. Uh, got us these. We got a working, um, some subs in there, I think. I think Epic Deli, actually. Our drummer, Mark, is friends with the Epic Deli crew, so they brought us a bunch of uh, Epic Deli sandwiches. Uh, this is where we keep all of our odds and ends. Obviously, we're on tour, so bottles and bottles of ibuprofen. Dayquil and Nyquil, you know what it is. Always gotta have those in here. Thank God for scented trash bags I was just saying somehow I got turned into the housemaid of the rig so I'm always cleaning and picking up everybody's trash so it helps to have the scented uh, trash bags if we feel like popping in a rotisserie chicken we got the oven here make some Tostitos pizza do a broiler no that's not a broiler but if it was a broiler we'd be doing steaks in there um, some tabletop burners if you want to make some ramen noodles for all you college kids out there that eat the Eat the ramen noodles every day. Um, we got our fridge here. Pretty bare bones. Some LaCroix, some peanut butter and jelly, some snack packs, some Topa Chico, some Sunny D for our drummer because he drinks and eats like a five-year-old. So you know what it is. Uh, nothing in the freezer really. Let's see what we got in here. This thing's always tricky. Nothing. Should have pizza rolls, but we got nothing. Uh, this is our kitchenette. This is where we sit. This is where I'll do all of our fun paperwork stuff at the end of the night. Or Mitch, our merch guy, will crunch all the numbers. So this is our mini office during uh, the night after the show. Our hangout pad during the day. At night, this bad boy flips down into... If you can get it. Folds down to the bed. This pops out. This goes over. And you got a full day bed for whoever gets stuck sleeping on this little guy. But it gets the job done. Um, got our trusty window in case anybody on the tour needs anything from us. And, hey guys, can we get some Topo Chico? Can we get some Sunny D? And we'll hand them out stuff out of the window. So this is actually, so we have more room now than ever because we have our extension out. So when we pop this thing out, obviously we have way more room in here. We can fit another bed if we need to. But usually this extension is right here on the wall. 
we'll pull that in and our extender goes all the way back into here. So we just have a nice little hallway when we're driving. Everybody can still sleep, but we have our, our table up. But the extension is an absolute game changer for us on the road, especially when we're parked for the day and we can plug in and just kind of stretch out a little bit. If we want to have people on the road or digital tour bus with us, we have a little bit more room to get in here and, and uh, move around and not be cramped up together. So it makes all the difference having that slide come out. The biggest game changer for this rig, as any band knows, is going to the bathroom on the road. Few and far between. You have to stop. Everybody's always peeing in bottles. The bottles get left. Sometimes they get spilled. You don't want that. So this right here is the creme de la creme of what we got. Turn on the light. A working bathroom. To be able to go to the bathroom while you're on the road in the touring band, there's nothing like it. It is real rock star type shit. And that's saying a lot. But just having a bathroom to be able to go to the bathroom while we're moving around makes all the difference. So I'm about to show you guys to the last little bit of our RV where myself and Eric sleep. This is where Eric, our fill-in, sleeps. I don't know how he got a bed being a fill-in. That's up to Mark. Somehow the fill-in guy is, is sleeping on a nice bed back here with me. This is my digs. This is where I sit here and, and uh, uh, talk to my wife and tell the guys to drive slower because I can feel every little bump in the road. So I'm always third wheel driving. Hey, slow down back there. Hey, 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 quit accelerating so fast. That's me. Uh, my trusty um, humidifier to make sure that I'm, uh, 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 I'm uh, nice and hydrated every night. So I'm not up and uh, all scratchy up there each night. Tons of storage. Got my gold chains. Got my rags. See dirty clothes on this side, some socks. We got uh, my gym bag. We uh, we are avid Planet Fitness uh, uh, stoppers. We stop there each night. Uh, it kind of makes touring for us um, livable because we can't shower on here as much. So we will pull into a Planet Fitness most nights, and uh, we'll go in. We'll get a workout in. We'll get a shower in, and then back to the digs. Uh, same thing with Eric. More storage. I tell you what, these, these fill-in guys are, are really living the dream here with all this room. It's madness. And uh, that's really it. That's really it as far as, ah, we got this. Our closet. This is where all of our stage clothes go. Nice and sweaty and full of salt stains. Um, Mark brought a blazer for some reason. I don't know why. Um, you know what it is. This some massage, some socks. hidden gummy bears don't go wrong fuse box and uh i think that about wraps it up so we have a brand new record coming out march 10th on a rising empire records for the fallen dreams our first self-titled album uh march 10th please uh check it out uh, give it a spin we got new music out um you can find us at ftfd band on instagram for the fallen dreams on facebook ftfd band on twitter and tiktok and we can't wait to see y'all next time we get back out on the road see you guys